Bronx Bell and D train. Next stop is 34th Street, Herald Square. Also, if you see the love of my life, Diane, she's 5'4", brunette, and has just the cutest little baby hands. Please take your trash when you leave the train. This is a Bronx Bound D train. Dan, if you're on this train, I, I know I'm a selfish lover, but tell me, would a selfish lover cry during intercourse? You know, he's not on this train. Diane's new steady, Ted. Ted drives a Honda Fit, so he doesn't have to take the subway. And he's in a sublime cover band. <laughs> I can learn reggae bass too. <laughs> Please watch your step as you exit the train. This is the Bronx Bound D train. The next stop is Rockefeller Center. Dan and I went ice skating here. I'm going to get a cold chap. Baby hands around their huge mug of hot chocolate. The mom is, of course, right with her size. In her baby hands. This is the Bronx Bound D train. Stand clear of the closing doors. I'd like to take one keepsake from every relationship to remember the good times. In this relationship, I took Diane's ferret, Sydney. She dumped me in Central Park and had a picnic basket full of watercress sandwiches. My favorite. I tried giving them away to homeless people, but nobody would take them. I ended up putting them in a cab to Yankee Stadium. I have a lot of free time now, so I learned some reggae bass. <laughs> I didn't cry when Diane left that day on the subway. I got home and Diane left her jeans. Now I'm wearing them stretching out the seams. Diane's jeans is what I've got. I said I'm wearing them. Diane's jeans is what I've got. I said I'm wearing them. Thank you. This is the Bronx Bound D train. Stand clear of the closing doors. You know, Diane and I talked about children. She said I wasn't ready. When I stole the child from that park, who was the one that called the cops? Not me. Except <laughs> <laughs> far on the fair. He's extremely agitated right now. He's not on my shoulder. Please watch your step as you exit the train. This is the Bronx Bound D train. I followed Ted home yesterday. He might be good at reggae bass, but he's no Superman. I don't watch him sleep. I didn't sleep with so special. Except for a sleep at me once. I could easily get one of those. Yep. I don't know if we'll ever forget Diane. She lives on the Upper East Side now. Ladies and gentlemen, change of plans. We're being rerouted to Lexington Avenue towards the Upper East Side. Next stop, 86th Street. We're gonna get those baby hands back. Oh.